All right, so we're still here in Sao Paulo, Brazil. This time we're in Brooklyn. It's a neighborhood here in Brazil. Pretty cool little neighborhood, but that's because that's where Dream Art is located. So Dream Art's just on the other side of these walls. And uh, yeah, I'm excited to check in with these guys. I think Azaki Bayens is gonna be leading the class. Obviously people like A-Rod are gonna be there. But one thing we're really curious about this year is kind of this color belt rivalry between Alliance and Dream Art. It kind of dominates the color belt days. It's like the most electric thing going on in the pyramids during blue belt, purple belt, brown belt matches. It always seems like it ends up being a Dream Art versus Alliance semifinal or final. So we're gonna get to uh, get to see a little bit more about how these purple belt, brown belt, blue belt cats are training. I'm excited to get in there, so let's do it. Good morning. things off here at Dream Art with some specific drills, a lot of different variations of back takes depending on how their partner reacts and stuff. Now listen, a lot of you watching this video, I see you commenting and when you comment, I click on your profile and I look at the videos you posted. So you know, I've seen that little, that little round you posted with your buddy and a lot of you need to do some of these drills, take some notes and work on your back takes, all right? No offense, but you guys, you guys need, might need to drill this one a little bit. So uh, get out your pen and paper and uh, take some notes here. Every single day is hard. We have just like competitors in the mat. We have about like normally in our training, we have about uh, 45, 50 athletes. And uh, all these athletes is young guy. More, we have more like polo belts and uh, they are really hungry, you know, to, to win the tournaments. And uh, the training is always amazing. We start some uh, movements, like movements to take the back. And then we start with special training back take. We have a lot of talents here. We have a lot of nice color belts and I think we get the, the world title this year again. <laughs> it's close but I think we, we get again. Alright, now I think they've moved on to some of the sparring rounds. I think they're doing groups of four, similar to what we saw at Alliance where one guy goes back to back, a little bit of a shank, shark tank, excuse me, a little bit of a shark tank there, but getting the sparring going now. always was like focused more in the black belt. They have a, like a big like uh, team in the best of the words. We created the dream art. The focus is more like color belts. And then after, after that, uh, Alliance created the institute to, to help the, the color belt too. I think uh, they motivate us and uh, we motivate the Alliance to, to be better, you know. Uh, and uh, it's always a war. Always like when the ter big tournaments coming, uh, normally, always like a dream match against uh, Alliance in the last like three years, you know. And uh, I think it's great. It, it's good because it's it's helped us a lot, you know, to, to growing and uh, they start to help a lot of like uh, Colo Belt athletes. And uh, it is uh, I think it's amazing for this sport. <laughs> Colorbird has a lot of pressure, you know. They growing a lot, and we they get the black belt. It's just one more day, one more competition, uh, because they fight in the pressure, you know. <laughs> you, I don't know if you saw the last words uh, when Jumart found an alliance. It's really crazy. It's like a 
black belt, black belt final. My, my last one world championship with the gear. I'm not like re retired, but I think uh, I'm like a little tired about like uh, every single year, you know, fighting like the world championship. And today we have a more opportunity, you know, we, we have a, like a lot of super fight. I'm not like retired from Jiu Jitsu, Jiu Jitsu is my life. I saw like people's when move to MMA, they like forget about Jiu Jitsu, you know, and uh, I, I don't will forget that Jiu Jitsu is my life. Jiu Jitsu uh, gave me like everything. And uh, I will keep li leaving the, the Jiu Jitsu world. He is a bad guy. Yeah. Gangsta, I'm gangsta, bro. I'm gangsta. OG. I call him. Woo. I call him the OG. Really bad guy. I just thank you guys for coming here. It's a, a pleasure uh, see you guys in Brazil. It's really nice. I just saw Flo Replin USA or and then another competition. You guys be here is really nice. Thanks so much. Beleza, galera. Valeu. Obrigado pelo treino. Os. All right, that's a wrap here at Dreamart. Great checking in with these guys. Great seeing Izaki and A Rod. And now we're going to be uh, flying back to California, flying to San Diego. So, next time you guys see me, we're going to be on a plane headed to San Diego. Yeah.